Okay, guys, welcome to Cedarcraft. Oh my god, I forgot how much it lags. I can't find something in settings that fixes this. Um, I'm working on my house thing for the creative build off, except I think I'm just gonna do that later. Um, gonna go. Oh, who's this in our house? Don't mess with him. Okay. Don't mess with him. Don't mess with him. Go away. Okay. Basically, Christian was telling me that there were like these new noobs who like came to the server and they found our place and took our diamonds and gold blocks and stuff. That's not allowed. So they were just banned. Um and now they're resetting our chests. So I'm just gonna I don't know. Um it's not much to do. Yeah, I might as well show you guys these secret rooms. Christian secret room is this one. Made it a nice little place here. Um, so yeah, this is Christian's secret place. Mine is kinda not very secret because they just put torches all around. And there's this lever here. It's just, you know, a little room. Who took my crafting table and my bed? It's Christian, did you take my crafting table and beds from my secret room? Because somebody, somebody took them. I did it this morning. You took them? Can you please give them to me? What? So secret room. Well, it's not very secret. Seriously. Okay. There's beds in the crafting table. No, no. You took the nether wart and did not put any back. I did not. That was stolen. That's why I have access. Oh. Did they take our heads? Okay, why is there just a Steve head where Jeremy was? Oh okay, yeah, I got I gotta say who Jeremy and basketball players. So Jeremy was a zombie pigman who came from our nether portal. And you know, he was our friend and then one of our friends who was on the server, his name's Dominic. He like made a cage and put Jeremy in there. We were just like, no, Jeremy deserves to be free. So Quinn just goes in there and kills Jeremy. Basketball player. Um, so at one point, at one point, we had a ton of sheep and stuff. They were all white sheep. I'm not trying to sound racist. But, um, you know, um, they, the animal pens were not lit up properly. So, basically, creepers spawned. We tried to kill them, and then they blew up, and all of our sheep died. Also, that happened to our pigs. Now, there were two sheep that I found. I tried to lead them both to our house at the same time. I gave them names. 
the one that I just declared as a girl, I named Matrice. The other one, its name was Basketball Player. Now, he drowned. So you're probably thinking, how? How would that happen? Well, the area here wasn't very developed. So, like, up here was just, it was dirt. There wasn't, like, this road or anything. or We had this waterfall and fishing hole. So I was leading basketball player. Matrice over here. Matrice is just like, nope, not going in there. Jumps down into sheep pen. Basketball player was just like, what? And then he drowned. Because they couldn't get him to swim. He didn't know how to swim. He drowned. And it was. You murdered him. No, I did not murder him. I'm going to blame it on you, Quinn. Oh, cool. Netherboard. Yay. You need to thank him, Christian. Were all of our chests reset? Hmm. Right now, it's just kind of boring, um, just walking back and forth. So we're not really, not really having thing to do right now. So I think I'm gonna. Uh, okay, sorry about that. I had to pause it for a second. My dad came in. Christian, do you have food on you? Or is this not a good time? I'm just gonna... Um, how much money do I have? I have zero. I have zero ember. Ember. Um, I'm just gonna find something to do on this server really quick I'm just gonna pause it pause it um I guess I am gonna work on this creative mode thing contest um know what I should do what the heck this this giant thing just came overnight I guess I'm gonna go check it out magics and sorcery Is this like not secret headquarters of a satanic cult or something? It's a dark cage like thing. And there's netherrack. And then there's this guy. And then there's this top floor that you have to fly up to to get in it. This is just kind of stupid. But someone's probably going to come to my house and be like, Wow, this is so stupid. <laughs> then I'll just be like, <laughs> Depression. <laughs> Let's check out this guy's stupid house. It's too stupid. What? I can't hear what you're saying, Quinn. Talk louder. I apologize. For what? Not talking loud enough. Okay. I'm going to talk like this. No, you're talking too loud. Stop. So now I'm talking too loud. Yes. Well, um, time's up, so bye, you noobs.